Thanks for joining me for my walk in Northeast Portland. I've been doing a lot of walking since we've been staying at home and not going out for exercise. And I've been thinking about walking. It's interesting. A lot of folks that I see in the neighborhood are using their Fitbits and other types of pedometers. And I hear a lot of people talking about the importance of getting their 10,000 steps in. Well, here's the funny thing about 10,000 steps. It's really not scientifically grounded at all. Uh, one of the first pedometers that came out was called the Manpoke, which means 10,000 steps in Japanese. It was a Japanese pedometer and it was a huge sensation. Uh, but really the science shows that any sort of walking, whether it's 6,000 steps or 8,000 steps, is really about as productive as 10,000. There's no scientific basis in that number 10,000. A lot of times there's established wisdom that isn't necessarily so wise and we have to be willing to investigate alternative possibilities. And one of the best ways to do this is just to stay creative. So I've noticed when I walk, I tend to stay on the same paths. I walk up certain streets one way, I come down streets another way, and I tend to stay in the same grids in terms of walking. Well, when I get outside my grid, when I walk down new roads, when I reverse direction, I see all of these new things and exciting uh, gardening and really cool things that people are doing to their houses. And I think this is such a perfect metaphor for what we should think about doing now. We don't necessarily have to just stay on our expected paths. In fact, I would argue that right now it's almost impossible to do this if you're in business. If you want to succeed in this age of pandemic, you're not going to succeed with the business plan that you had at the beginning of the year. You have to be willing to shift it around. And it could be that you have the right steps, or in other words, the right products and services, but you might just need to alter the way that you offer them. What I'm finding in my business is that we are changing the way we talk to our clientele about our products and services. And we're not sticking with the old plan. We're doing new things in terms of the dialogues that we're having with customers, and we're having success with this. So it's really important that we all in this time of pandemic be willing to get out of our comfort zones, experience things a little bit differently, open ourselves up to new possibilities. And yes, this year is not going to be the one that we expected at all. It's going to be a lot more challenging. But if we're willing to take new roads and to bring some creativity to the way we do things, there's no reason why all of us can't have a successful year. Thank you and have a terrific week.